Hello everybody, my name is Blake and this week we are talking about trans assumptions. Many times when a transgender person comes out to family or friends, they are questioned. The first question that comes out of everybody's mouth is, so you're gay? So to clear things up, gender identity has nothing to do with your sexual orientation or who you're attracted to. But another thing is that some people don't understand that if you are a transgender male, which means you identify as a guy, um, if you like girls, that means you're straight. If you like boys, that means you're gay. And kind of the opposite for trans females, if they like guys, they're straight. If they like girls, they're gay. That is another thing that confuses people because people assume that your private parts define you. It's kind of like if somebody has skin cancer, a skin disease, or they're missing a limb. Um, we don't look at them and define them by that, do we? No, so um, you shouldn't define a transgender person on their private parts. Transgender people might be confused at first, and that is only because there are natural labels placed upon you at birth, as in you were born male or female in society and your parents and you grow and you think that you need to act like that certain gender. The only confusing thing is, is that if you are young and you have no idea what transgender is, it is a terrible and confusing feeling because you just think that there's something wrong with you. So yes, it might be confusing at first, but if somebody identifies as transgender, they are no longer confused and you should respect that they identify as transgender. Talking about trans women here, a lot of people assume that they are just drag queens. That is not the case and a little fun fact, drag queens, a lot of them aren't even transgender. They don't identify as female. The last topic I want to cover is that people assume that transgender people are just people who like to dress in the opposite clothing. If it was that simple, that would be awesome, but that's just not the case. Tomboys wear boy clothes and they're not transgender, as well as some lesbians wear guy clothes and that doesn't make them transgender. Just because somebody is dressing in an opposite sex's clothes, is it so opposite sexes? Yeah, clothes, that does not make them transgender. But that also leads to a lot of opportunities to be misgendered, so maybe we can hit that topic on a later week. I'll see you guys next week. Have a good one. Bye.